friend, I'm Olivia. Welcome back to Cave Story Plus. We are on a mission to uh, find the red flowers and collect some dogs. But before we can go rescue the puppies, we need to defeat a mini boss. If I could. Thank you. Now if I walk on the sand down there, a big crocodile is going to jump out and bite me. It's not going to be fun. Yes, I would like to say. So in this particular area, and where there's a, where there is sand at the bottom, is likely trapped. We don't want to get hit by that one. Because that would kill us, and that would be bad. I would really, really like some Doritos of power ups, though. has gone really badly really quickly. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Let's try again.
Let's not make the same mistake twice. He's blundered yet another time. Hmm. You have a lot of spirit. However, to come all the way here, you're a bit troublesome. Do you want to take me on? Oh, it doesn't seem like it'll be necessary. Bye now. the sunstones is lifted. Awesome! Much rather be at level three. Great. Lovely. Thanks. Yes. 
five for five. Thank you. I want to go down. Have the dog. You've returned him to me. That was very nice of you. What? The red flower? Oh yeah. <laughs> How you doing, Auntie? Oh, it's you, Belrock. You look good. How's my stupid daughter been lately? Ha! Huh. Stupid daughter? You mean misery? She's also fine. A new master has appeared. This time, the surface will finally be ours. Are you two still trying to do that? I'm not here to cause you any trouble. I just came by to pick up the key to the warehouse. You know, the warehouse with the flower seeds. Huh. I have no idea what you're talking about, Falrock. Is that so? You're just pretending that you don't know. I see now. You're going to be... You're going to betray us then. Isn't... Is that it? You'll be sorry. A new master. It must be another idiot. At it yet again. About my dogs. I have four more still. My little pups. But these legs of mine are so very weak. Sorry for the inconvenience, but would you mind finding the rest of my dogs for me? Sure. They're puppies. They, they, they should be with their, with their family. Puppy, that's a hot container. Open the trip. Oh, there's the puppy. Okay. So this is puppy number two. beloved little dogs. By the way, you must be a soldier from the surface. It's been a long time since all those robots, just like you, came to this island. They were responsible for the deaths of so many defenseless Mimiga, and for the lives of the brave men and women who tried defending the Mimiga. Due to the efforts of consuming the forbidden red flower, the cornered Mimica became utterly rabid. They fought back viciously against the robots that had invaded their island. Who knows? Had there been no red flower, it's very possible that the Mimica on this island might have been annihilated. Three more left. I know you can do it. Let's save. Because I make dumb mistakes. Oh, 
Ah, yes. This is why I like this one so much. During Halloween, this was much, much easier. Woof, 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 yes, yes. Let's go. So this is dog number three. Where is, where is dog number four? I died. Yes, please. this again, but better. Bombing, my greatest weakness. Okay, okay. Puppy number three. Oh, definitely. That one's mine. Gave her the dog. Thank you so much. This one makes three. Have you ever seen an enraged mimicker? Eating the red flower will make me stronger. A great many of the mimicker believed this and chose to eat the red flower. Then, and only then, did they fight back against the battalions of robots. But, do you know what happens afterwards to the mimicker filled with such rage? It was so terrible. Perhaps they couldn't control themselves. Well, most of the Mimiga who consumed the red flower were never to be seen again. They went missing. I heard a rumor that they supposedly made it down to the surface, where the humans live. The thought of the enraged Mimiga anywhere close to the surface, with humans, 
If it's really true, do you yet realize it? Do you realize how dangerous the red flower actually is? Two more pops. I think, I think I remember where the last couple puppies are. There's one that runs back and forth. And then there's one later. No, don't run away! Oh. Excellent. Thank you. Alright. Up. Yeah. There we go. Up. You are the popular one. My dogs aren't very fond of troublemakers either. I really do appreciate all your hard work so far. Isn't the warehouse key that you're after? The same warehouse that contains all the red flower seeds in it? It doesn't matter to me who you are, understand? I can't give you the key to the warehouse. Sorry. Opening the warehouse would be foolish, allowing an encore of the same tragedy from before. One, two, three, and four. Only one more to go. You know, if protagonist, little robot protagonist here, could speak and say that um, they plan to, to burn all the seeds in the warehouse, and make sure nothing bad ever happened with those seeds ever again. I think that should be all for giving us the, the key. I think she'd be okay with that. Ah oh yes, it's time for the platforming. The hardest part of this game. Hmm, because cause I have no skills. fall down when they get hit. Very much and well. 
Oh, I need that. You need that? It's better than nothing. Please, I'd really like to not die. I'd really, really like to not die. When did I save it last? Four dollars. Okay, four dollars. <clears throat> Excellent. Let's not screw up this time, yes? Yes. Lucky skeleton thing. I'm almost dead. Sledge, and then we'll take a break, and I will continue on in the next video. But until then, once again, I am Olivia, and this is Cave Story. And until next time, you have a safe journey.